Oh my fucking god! <laughs> I thought... I thought reloading the save would fix this! G'day mates, I'm Remy and welcome back to City Skylines. Now last time we were playing around with the One Tile City, I guess, challenge of sorts. Just a screw around really. And I was wondering what would happen if you cut off all the uh, highway access, if you can actually still have a functional city. So I decided to, you know, build a whole city around that idea. Can you see what I was trying here? Where is Downstream going to be for a stri- <gasps> Please tell me Downstream is New Zealand. God, I love- what the fuck? What the fuck is that? Oh god, it's a very, very blurry jet plane. Okay, where are you even going? You're flying to Renville? Hang on a second. Oh god! Um, uh, pilot? Oh, oh no, okay. Alright, time to check the water flow and... What the fuck is... What is this? This is not... Are there just geysers in the ocean? Jesus Christ, the Nazca lines are on Tasmania. Well, found where we're sticking our poo. Shoreline recommended. Get out of here. Tasmania will do just fine. So like previously stated, the whole idea is that we're not going to use external highways in this run. I want to see how big we can actually get the city going. That means... I'm sorry, Oliver Finch Bridge, but uh, yeah. You gotta go. I do like that Adelaide and most of South Australia has just been relegated to being a beach. It's just a big old fucking... Yep, alright, this is where we go for our parties. We're gonna make Adelaide into a great party district at some point. I also noticed that we can apparently just colonize part of Indonesia, which is apparently just a giant fucking jungle. Alrighty tidy whitey, so um, just ignore this abomination of a fucking railway <laughs> Oh, it's so bad. God, we sure do love our bridges in Australia. Bloody hell, all right. Well, this ain't Sydney, but let's get things kicking off. Ignore, like, the ferry stops. Look, I had enough trouble with those. I hate them already. But uh, let's see if we can actually get some people in. Oh, we have got houses, though. Houses are being built. But then again, I'm pretty sure that, you know, sometimes they'll just build anywhere that works because this is City Skylands and people appear out of thin fucking air, apparently. But, uh, hey, okay, we, we we have houses, but no people in them. Oh shit, we got our first three people. How did you get here? Wait, did I just see a car? No, no cars so far. And who, where, where are, oh god, we're actually getting, is it, is it the bloody airport? Nope, there's no passenger serviced here. How are people getting in the city? No passengers, so, how are these people getting here? I mean, I don't see any cars, but, yeah, there are people here somehow. They're actually living here. There's a, there's a dog. Wait, is that a dog? That's that's a cougar. What the fuck is a cougar? T oh god. Oh my god, cars, where did all of you come from? Wait, the ferry? No, no, the ferry. Actually, wait, there are a few here. <gasps> yeah, okay, it's people getting off the ferry. Okay, they're bringing their cars with them, I guess. Oh my god, alright, people are here, people are living. That cougar is still sort of kicking around. I'm gonna call you, uh, Steve. Steve the cougar. Please don't eat our children. There's an earthquake inbound? What the fuck? Where? Why? What? God damn it. Oh, it's just in the fucking ocean. All right, well, that's really not odd to concern. Okay. Beginning to feel a lot like the Japanese right now, you know? Ah, they've discovered why our cargo is having issues. This is how we tend to offload it. <laughs> oh, god damn it. I like how they just sort of shimmy it up like, you sure? Yep, all right, Captain. We're really, everyone get out and push. I, are you, I, really, really? Are you kidding me? It has been like five minutes. That's just the ocean. Why does this game just fucking hate the ocean? Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, what? I'm sorry, the media strike Rhineland? Uh, hang on, hold on, hold on just a moment. You know, I'm not seeing any German troops, but uh, I'm giving it a real good look under there. Just really quite concerning. Okay, one weird thing is I don't seem to have any demand for industrial officers, and I'm not quite sure why. Like, I'm really trying, and you'll see what I'm trying to do in a moment, but just no one wants it. Like, wh are we just getting all of our uh, goods from the uh, airports and stuff so we don't actually need to produce it? Oh, for fuck's sake. Morning. I think it's just because I've got so many cargo areas that I don't actually have to worry about supplying my guys with anything. So, I'm going to try something real quick, just because I want to build some industry somewhere. Yep, there we go. Immediately, we get a demand for industry. So, if you're wondering why I needed that industrial demand, it's because I've exported all of my industry to <laughs> Indonesia for that cheap, cheap Asian labor, so we can uh, ship it all back to the mainland. It's ignore that what this harbor is called, right? Just, just, just pass by, please. And uh, we've got like some little shanty town here that they can all live in. 
And uh, then we've got, of course, the uh, the industry, a bit of commercial, and these two planes that are just circling the island, and they won't stop. They've been doing this for like 10 minutes now. Oh my fucking god, why? Why are there more of them? Oh my god. Okay, hypothesis. They can't land because if they were going to do their landing routine, it would take them outside of the map and they can't actually do that. So instead they just circle this fucking airport forever. I love it. I'm gonna leave it like that. Oh, welcome back. It's the next day. I'm slightly hungover. Let's continue playing this. So, I've made a little decision as I've uh, sort of been making this town grow. I had a very groggy moment of just sort of uh, looking after this place when I was waking up. Uh, let's look- Oh my fucking god! I thought reloading the save would fix this. There's even planes that are sat here. Why are they doing this? Right. I, I, I made a choice that I was going to connect these guys up to the train line. Oh, fuck. There's a lot of bad shit over here. <laughs> Holy shit. Right, I'm gonna connect up the- the fucking Indonesian lads by a train because I want to actually make sure we can get some, like, workers in on the train and get the goods out. <laughs> it's just still making me... Oh, laugh. Okay. <laughs> There's another one that just joined the flock. Oh, fuck me. But now there's also another train station here, a couple of people, and it's got all the helicopter depots for Indonesia to be looked after. Holy fuck, the planes are reaching critical mass. Oh, and everyone's on fire over here now. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. Indonesia is a hellhole. Uh, let's just build a couple of watchtowers around here so we can alert the authorities that the place is a bit on fire. I'm just gonna build a fire station here as well because things are going really poorly. Anyway, uh, we, we are now building goods here. We've got some cargo trains and some train stations, so hopefully we do actually get goods being built. We'll get some, like, people, some, uh, workers shipped in once they stop burning to death. And, uh, we can actually ship goods back to the main town. Uh, all the way over back of the mainland. I'm basically creating my own external raw resources. Except, we've apparently conducting a bombing campaign on them right now. Holy Jesus, fuck. I wonder how many raw ma- like, no wonder they're all like, we can't get any raw materials! No shit, look at the fucking sky! Yeah, we're, we're filling them up. Like, we're actually putting all of our raw resources into the- you know, I'm just gonna- I gotta turn the airport off. I think it's taking all of our resources. Wait. Oh my god, the plane left? Really? Alright, well I'm just gonna leave these guys here. But yeah, the raw resources just weren't getting to the towns because they were just going to the bloody airport instead. Holy shit! I think I just did a ferry route successfully. I still hate these things and have no idea how they actually work, but I've just built the worst place in the world. <laughs> it's a little, like, ferry-only colony. The only way to get here is through this ridiculously stilted ferry that you have to sort of... Oh, look at, look at all, like, little boys they're meant to follow. How are you meant to guide this? Like, I, I know how to drive a boat. I haven't got my fucking license and shit. And even I... Wait, are they meant to, like, climb up these poles? God damn, you gotta be hardcore to get around on these ferries, alright. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Why would you want to live here? Oh my god. Maybe to get away from Victoria. I mean, I'm not sure what's worse right now. We got Brisbane, which is essentially a colony purely for flying helicopters. It's just a bunch of pilots whose sole purpose is to fly over to Indonesia, <laughs> witness all of this shit, and uh, drop some fire retardant material on them, hopefully to stop the, uh, the endless stream of deaths. Then you got Indonesia, where you're basically just existing to make resources for the rest of the continent. And then we've got- we come back down to Victoria, where it's a giant, you know, lovely city, but it's all getting packed in quite- Like, the, the traffic's really nice, I quite like this design. But, uh, you literally just- <laughs> you, you've, There's no external roads, all of your goods are made from, like, some poor children in Indonesia. And there's just trains and planes everywhere. And then you go across on this little bridge I've built. And we got a prison in Tasmania. That's the only reason to go here. Why are people going all the way across to Tasmania to turn around? What the fuck? Oh shit, also- Oh god, I've just realized. How did I not notice we've flooded Tasmania? Oh fuck. All the poo waters flooded Tasmania. Thank god I looked over here. Oh god, why? Oh no, it's gonna escape. No, 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 no escaping. Oh shit. 
Oh god, Australia is such a prison island. We've built our own prison island. And it's even worse because the prisoners just get this beautiful view. Hang on, no, no. They don't have enough of a view. Let's let's smoothen this out, shall we? There we go. The prisoners get a beautiful view of just a giant shit tsunami at all times raging within the bowels of Tasmania. Oh, I think I know what's happening. Okay, so the real problem here is that the Indonesians need loads more people to actually work in the factories. So the uh, residential demand's going way, way up. But because all the residential I build on the mainland can't actually reach Indonesia for the most part, because they don't want to all get on like a 20 hour train to go to work, uh, I just keep getting a residential demand. We keep building uh, houses, but they don't actually have any jobs and nowhere to go. Why is the land value so here? Let's just get some parks here. <laughs> like, that's, that's my real problem right now, not the fact that Indonesia is just a hellhole. I made the poo hole worse. Like, people say that they live in these households and shit, but there's no one actually around. Like, this is like one of those North Korean fake towns. Okay, we found some people. Right. You work? You work in Indonesia! You work in Indonesia, really? What? What? What the fuck? You live here. You Hold on. Let's let's just run through a day in the life of Anna Hunter. She lives in her residence in the Anchor residence. She gets on her fucking ferry. She goes over to here, climbs up these fucking stilts and crosses across, presumably walking because I don't maybe that's her car there. She walks across, gets on the wrong way on the highway, or maybe she goes all the way around and gets on the right way. Then, how does she even turn around? She's not even on the internet. So maybe she gets on here and she pulls a fucking, like, a, a weird turn. Okay, and then she's going the right way. Okay, she goes up on the interchange, <laughs> drives all the way down, pulls up over at Organic... No, that's, that's her workplace, sorry. At New Commercial Center. She parks here. Okay, that's fine. Then she drives around, goes around through here, onto a train, jumps on a train all the way north. Wait, no, sorry. Takes wrong turn. Uh, wait, no, no, she has to go, she has to go around here, come back around this way, all the way across, and finally pull into the train station, get off, and go to work at Organic Foods, which isn't even an industry, it's a commercial building! In Indonesia, she must work in like yearly installments. She like stays in her home for like a month at a time. Then she goes on a big journey to buy her like fucking winter rations <laughs> before working for the summer season in Indonesia and coming back home. What the fuck, Anna Hunter? What the actual fuck? It's gotten so much worse. This is probably gonna crash my game at some point. Announcing Airport 2. That's right, this is a passenger airport to bring in workers for the industry. Hopefully this will help out. <laughs> Indonesia's plane ring is now visible from space. What the fuck is happening here? What the fuck? What are these? Are these cargo planes? Oh my god, it's made a second ring. There weren't... <laughs> Enough room in the first ring! So it's made a second one over here! What the fuck is happening? Why? Oh my god, it's on fire again! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> I was like, why are they doing the different circle? But these are the jet planes! These are cargo planes! These are the jet- Oh my god! There's more! Two more came in to join them! I thought this airport was actually working because it was servicing passengers! But no! <laughs> it started the circle as well! What the fuck is happening? Oh my god, wait. Look at this. You can see there's another circle. Oh my god. <laughs> there's another circle beyond the map. What do the circles mean, Mason? And Victoria's now having a massive economic issue because they're all trying to, uh, like, all the goods are in the air. Do you know how many resources are in the air right now? It is amazing to see how much Victoria actually relied on Indonesia because because all the fucking goods are stuck in the air right now, we are just losing all of our, uh, commercial, and we can't actually build any more industrial because all the industrial's already over here. And it's actually working well. It's just, you know, it's just the goods are going nowhere. Oh man, I feel so bad for these guys. You know what I think we're done? We've created a beautiful Tasmania, which is still filling up. We've actually got some industry here now, which means we're feeding our guys. I mean, Indonesia actually was working and was working really well until... Okay, right here. There we go. Okay, you can just see it from the side of Victoria. You can see the planes flashing their warning lights. Uh, anyway, but yeah, we've got this all working now. 
We've got the little fairy towns which actually work and I don't understand how. <sighs> Whatever. And uh, we've got some beautiful shipping going on. Like, I was actually really happy to see that this could work. I decided my beach in Adelaide needed to be a bit bigger. So oh. Oh, it's only as I'm making the beach bigger right now I realized I never built that beach town in Adelaide. Anyway, let's just uh, expand this a little bit more. See? Told ya. Made the beach much bigger. There we go. Now we can build a proper beach town. Let's just, uh, there we go. Just along here. Looking great. Brilliant, 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 brilliant. You just go connect up over to Ferry Town over here. So that in order to get to Beach Town, you gotta take a fucking ferry. Oh, wait. I was going, why are we out of water? I, I, I forgot we drank the water from the ocean as well. Yeah, that's, that's a bit unfortunate. Anyway, uh, I'll see you all next time. <laughs> Farewell. Fucking hell.